everyone, this is Tanya Homa. Um, this is a special edition from BYTV about Fort Lauderdale Fashion Week. Um, here we have Asa Sealy, all the way from the Caribbean. Um, he's here to talk to us a little bit about what he does and, you know, the fashion and the amazing fashion that he brings to this world. Um, so what inspired you to into fashion? Um, my inspiration came from all of my influences growing up, being from the Caribbean, being, um, being raised in Trinidad. Um, I was always surrounded by whether it be it a carnival costume or a folk performance. It, it was always, I was always surrounded by a lot of cultural type of influences. Um, and I think that I, I grew an appreciation for fashion then as a child. And just that just basically evolved into me as an adult now having an appreciation for, the, for, the, for, for good quality fashion and trying to represent Caribbean at the Caribbean at the same time. Okay, and uh, we're so excited to have you at Fort Lauderdale Fashion Week. Um, what can the attendees expect to see? Well, as the producer of Carib Style Week, which is uh, also a fashion week in Fort Lauderdale that focuses on Caribbean fashion, um, we have chosen this partnership strategically um, where we would be able to now give Fort Lauderdale Fashion Week a taste of what they could expect in June um, during Caribbean, fashion, uh, Caribbean Style Week. Um, so you expect some carnival, expect some, a lot of music, a lot of colors, a lot of, of swimwear. Um, you're just going to get a taste of, of the Caribbean. That's what we're going to bring to the table, something unique, um, something colorful, and something eloquent. Awesome, and it's so important to bring uh, back culture into this generation. Yes. So it's amazing that you're doing that. Well, we, we try to do that with everything that we produce, um, but there is a disconnect with this younger generation and culture, um, and we have a fond appreciation for it, and we are trying to express that as we share um, everything that we, we put out there for the general right. public. You know, We're hoping that they attach there, they feel a little bit more proud um, and uh, patriotic, so to speak, <laughs> as to where they came from. Right, and um, that's amazing. Would you say that is like what sets you apart from others in the fashion industry? Definitely. Um, uh, in, in, in the fashion industry, it's, it's a creative space. So mm -hmm. I think everyone, uh, no matter where they come from, being an individual in their, in their own right, um, brings that unique type of perspective. So um, for us, it's yes, we have an influence um, from the Caribbean, which makes it a little different. But at the end of the day, um, it's still that individual that's going to bring their flair and their perspective to the table. Right. Um, are you following any specific, you know, colors or patterns into your line? Well, definitely. You're going to look at mainstream colors and what's, what's in for the season. And um, we're definitely going to model after that because we don't want to go too much against the grain. Um, right. But at the same time, utilizing those basic colors and, and, and weaving our influences and, 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 and experiences into it, it's going to come out in the clothing that we That's produce. very beautiful. Um, so what in the future, like what do you plan on, do you plan on changing it into a different direction at some point or do you kind of want to stay true to that? Well, it's, it's, it's about growing, right? Mm -hmm. Everything that we do, it's, it's to be better. Um, uh, and uh, we, we, we are taking it day by day, um, influence by influence. Um, right. uh, you know, our times are changing, our economy is changing, society is changing. Um, and as that change occurs, um, it's going to be expressed through the line. So right. Carib Style itself, um, as a brand, as a line, as a clothing line, um, and as a designer behind the influences of that line, we would be definitely evolving with the time. Okay, that sounds amazing. You know, I'm so excited, and I'm sure all of you are excited, um, to attend Fort Lauderdale Fashion Week and tune into BYTV um, for updates on that. Thank you so much once again. This is Tanya and Isa. Yay! <laughs>